Uganda registers about 36,000 new cancer cases annually. However, only between 8,500 and 9,000 patients make it to the Uganda Cancer Institute for treatment, often in late stages of the disease. Experts say that managing cancer comes with several challenges. Treatments such as chemotherapy and pain management medications can cause side effects. That our patients normally, when they are undergoing treatment, they experience what we call mucositis. And this mucositis is just uh, a scientific term but referring to wounds. And normally these wounds run from the mouth until through the stomach, intestines, up to the harness. And so it's also very irritative, but also it worsens uh, the life of uh, the quality of life of the patient. And so this is one of the innovations that we have that is meant to manage uh, the wounds in the gut. Now, the Center for Natural Therapeutics at the Institute is developing herbal alternatives that are locally sourced, potentially less toxic. One of the key products under development targets prostate cancer. It means that somebody who is uh, ab above 45 years and is at risk of prostate cancer can use this, even if they don't have the cancer. But also our patients who are already on treatment can still use this, such that their disease cannot progress to another stage and so we start with animals and that is currently what we are doing so we expect to roll out uh, some of these products after a year to our patients for what we call clinical studies. The center showcased its work at the annual National Science Week which brought together innovators from various fields including health, energy and technology. In the energy sector, a group of young innovators are working on a monitoring system designed to address issues such as low voltage and electricity theft. The solution involves a system that connects to existing transformers, relays data to a platform known as Center Central. The difference with this solution is that we are able to pinpoint to a particular issue that is there on the line. So instead of sending a technician who is just going to come and let me say connect the fuse if it's the fuse that is off and he gets to site and it's the issues with the transformer and he can't sort out any issue with the transformer. This solution here is tailored to show you where the issue is. Although the innovation is still in development, the team says they are optimistic about its potential and are working towards making it ready for the market. We have developed a controller, a C650. With that controller, we will just be able to you make the payment with mobile money. We eliminate the token business and it just your light just comes into your home. You don't have to input the token, you don't have anything. No, but at Kunda, in TV News.